This video is about replacing the indicator light bulbs in a BioCard 9000 with SMD LEDs. For more information, please visit my blog at biolover.blogspot.com or go to my website at www.biolover.com. Here you see the light bulbs of the indicators with the covers removed. And so here we have them, one, two, three, four. And in this particular case, the light bulb for the record uh, calibration had a broken off lead. If you look real close here, you can see that, that this lead here is broken off. And the other light bulb that had an issue here was the time cal light bulb, which if you look here, it has a coating on the inside of the bulb. And that comes from an evaporating filament. And so these light bulbs needed to be replaced. So I decided to apply the approach that I developed for the Biomaster 8000 recently. And I developed uh, circuit boards with SMD LEDs that can replace these light bulbs. Since LEDs are polarized and light bulbs are not, we have to pay attention to the polarity of the solder points of the light bulbs for the LED replacements. And so it turns out that the record indicator light bulb has a polarity that is opposite to the polarity of the other three. So I had to develop a specific board for this one that would match this polarity. It's interesting to note that an intact light bulb, so I measure that on these two, is about uh, 26 ohms. That can help to identify if a light bulb already has a problem or not. This light bulb here, because of the thinning filament, had a larger resistance. Here you see the circuit boards that I designed, populated with the LEDs and the resistors. Uh, depending on the resistor, of course, one can control the brightness of the LEDs and so one can adjust the LED brightness to achieve the desired illumination of the indicators. This here is the special one for the record indicator with the reversed polarity. Here you see them after installation. The header spacing here is designed that they plug in directly into the pinholes for the light bulbs. Here you see old and new in comparison. And here with the red covers on. We decided to go with a little bit more light output uh, with the rebuilt indicators because the original uh, indicators are very poorly visible in brightly lit uh, room situations. Of course, if one wants to achieve the same brightness as the original light bulbs, then uh, larger resistors uh, for the LEDs will achieve that. And here you see them all on with the cover installed and you notice that the brightness of the indicators matches fairly well the brightness of the other displays. Well, now you know how to replace the indicator light bulbs with LEDs in a BioCard 9000. If you're interested in these little boards, they are available. Just send me an email. Thanks for watching.